In this segment, we'll look at how the hull is constructed. The hull is constructed in a female mold, beginning with the spray application of the exterior gel coat. Next, each boat gets a special skin coat formulated to prevent osmotic blistering. This outer skin is augmented with alternating layers of woven fabric and chopped strands, saturated with resin and rolled out to eliminate air bubbles. Each layer of fabric is mechanically pre-cut for a precise fit and packaged into ready-to-use kits for easy layup. Above the waterline, Hunter uses a sandwich panel construction to increase stiffness without adding extra weight. The lightweight core separates two skins of fiberglass, creating a rigid I-beam structure for superior hull strength. Below the waterline, it's all solid fiberglass with a layer of Kevlar reinforcement in the forward sections for extra impact resistance. The chain plate attachment points are heavily reinforced with extra fiberglass that wraps around the entire hull, distributing the load more evenly than conventional methods. Another vital component is the rudder shaft tube. It's primary bonded into the hull with base reinforcement, the strongest type of attachment for maximum strength. Once cured, the hull is ready for fusion with the reinforced grid and interior module. We'll take a closer look at that in the next segment, titled Modular Assembly.